the judge ordered Chronister to spend the next roughly two years in state prison, followed by three years probation. Now, his father, of course, the sheriff here in Hillsborough County, was not physically in the courtroom today, but certainly his presence loomed large over today's hearing. Wearing a lifelong scar on his face, Philip Manzi hurled venom at the man responsible for it, George Chronister, son of Hillsborough County Sheriff Chad Chronister. The first cut was centimeters from my eye. The second cut punctured my lung. I was left bleeding in a parking lot. But guess what, George? I'm still here. I'm still alive. When I walk out of here today, no matter what slap on the wrist you get due to your daddy, I'll be leaving this behind me. With my head held high and my family at my back, you'll be walked, locked away. Chronister stood emotionless, a vastly different posture than his actions during a brawl in 2017 when he stabbed Manzi in the face with a knife and punctured his lung. Chronister, an amateur rapper going by the name Z Chronic, wrote about the incident in a song called Slash Yo Face, which was played in court. Chronister initially tried to invoke the stand your ground defense, but the judge denied that. Wednesday at his sentencing, he offered an apology. It was not only stupid, but it was very immature, and um, I regret it deeply. Chronister's parents are divorced, and he shares only a distant relationship with his top cop dad, Manzi's father, telling the judge he expects justice. I was going to send a message today to all these wannabe rap stars thinking that jail and this thing is this thug life is a badge of honor. It's not a badge of honor. In the end, the judge ordered Chronister to spend 22 months in state prison, followed by three years probation. He was also ordered to stay off all social media. Then the son of the sheriff was led away in handcuffs. Now he was facing up to 15 years in prison. His mom begged the judge for leniency, worried about what his last name might mean in prison. She was worried that being the son of the sheriff, he would be attacked uh, in prison. Speaking of the sheriff, Mark, no comment from him tonight.